I did want to um, tell you about one new thing, two, actually two new things. Um, so, New World Cheap's the best, and she, you know, they sent her this information, um, and she put this on, you know, on her website saying that for the summer, this is Fergie's limited edition, it's just one thing this summer. Usually she comes out with a lot of stuff. Or Wet n' Wild comes out with a lot of stuff for Fergie. But this year, it, so far, this is the only display they've had uh, for the Summer Limited Edition. And the display, because not all stores are carrying these 10 pens. I think I've only seen them in four stores of out of the maybe 15 or 20 that I visited. Maybe five. Um, and um, they, they don't even have a space for this on their wall. They made their wall smaller because um, they... Um, they wanted to add new things like Queen, um, they have the Nani, they have the um, Eva Mendez, um, or Eva Mendez. Um, you know, they added more stuff on the wall, so they had to make the other dis their other you know displays small. Their other wall, their other wall displays smaller. So this isn't in, in every Walgreens, and so I'm not sure what happened, but for the summer. And, and again, I've only seen this in two stores for the summer. They put this out for, um, you know, for the summer display with the other two permanent products. I'm not sure if that will change, but, you know, I think what I did notice, maybe like more stores are carrying them, this, but yeah, they really made it smaller. So I got these, this one. And um, it's really pretty. It's that this green is just awesome sauce right there. That is just awesome sauce. That is a stunning green. It's got the tiniest bit of, of gold shimmer. They seem to be, I thought it might have been a teal, but it's really a stunning green. Um, it is more to the cool side. I would say it's more of a bluer green than a yellow green, but it is stunning. Um, the rest of these have a lot of gold shimmer, um, are kind of aqua-y or teal-y, um, turquoise -y, and you've got, then you've got your gold and your olives. It's a very stunning palette. Um, at first I wasn't sure if I would like it, but when I saw it in, in the store, I was like, oh yeah, that's mine. Um, along with that, I, um, my HEB did carry, um, did have the the displays and the lady there's you know she's so good to me she put me aside one of each color of uh, the the blush uh trio so i did get that and uh my friend my friend lulu since she wasn't sure that we're gonna have it here uh she she says she got me the pink one i taught pay for it she's coming down to live here so one of my favorite friends uh that i met on the internet is coming down to houston so i'm really excited about that so they were at Rite Aid, and yes, they are at Walgreens and HEB now. And I got the medium skin toned one. It's not as bright as the pink one, which is the one I originally wanted, which, like I said, my friend Lulu got for me a tall pair when she gets here. Um, but um, uh, it's I, it's selling out, and it's it's really nice. Um, I don't think I just watches of this. Come to think of it, I did try it, and it is absolutely gorgeous. I think I'm just waiting for my friend Lulu to bring me the other one. She'll be here. She should arrive tonight or tomorrow, and I'm sure she needs to settle in and all that. And then I'll do swatches of both. But yeah, these are these are the ones that are selling out in all the displays because it's the medium one. The other one's really bright, the pink and white, and then the other one's very bronzy. I thought this was gold, but it's actually, it's just, I don't know, just very neutrally, very pretty. I tried it on. It is so pretty. Um, and um, the other one's very bronzy and... Um, yeah, I, I, I guess that's for dark-skinned women. I, I didn't, personally didn't like it myself. It was very warm, very bronzy toned. Um, so I did find that. I didn't do, like I said, I didn't do swatches of this because I'm waiting to get my other one. So, but I, I did do swatches of this. Oh, by the way, it's called Lunch in Sa San Paulo. Or, Sa I guess, San Paulo? <laughs> But it, it's Brazilian, lunch in, lunch in San Paulo. And so, speaking of, of Wet n' Wild, um, they came out. I, I thought they were going to continu continue with the Silver Lake theme, but they came out. My, since my daughter works at Walgreens, she sent me a picture of a huge end, end cap display. Um, 
with uh, their summer collection, Wet n Wild Summer Collection, is called California Dreaming. Uh, and it seemed to have a lot of limited edition stuff. I'm not sure. I might have been mixing with some of the permanent stuff. Um, I guess that's how Wet n Wild got uh, Walgreens to carry limited edition stuff because you know that they didn't all the time. And so um, they have this display called California Dreaming, and it's got the, the lip balm, those lip balm pencils that came out last fall. They came out in their fall display, but they're very sheer. And my daughter says the purple sold out like that. Um, when she, by the time she got to the store, it was done. Um, my daughter is now a, a, a beauty consultant. She, so she kind of got a promotion. So that's really awesome. Um, so um, I guess she wasn't aware when it had come in. I guess as soon as it comes in, it gets put out. Um, two of, well, the Walgreens around my my way, the really good one that carries all the limited edition, told me that. If they get it, it'll be this weekend because it'll go out for May and it'll, you know, it'll be their summer stuff. Um, the one down by my son's uh, doctor, they also always carry everything. And as for the rest of the 20 Walgreens, it's a hit or miss. in Because uh, I know of the Walgreens out in Houston, I would say the, the Houston area that I lived in, uh, Houston towards my brother's house, the ones here in Pearland and in Alvin. I, I, and I've even found um, one, you know, the one where out in the uh, west more northwest where my daughter went to the doctor and um, that's a pretty good one too so i know where they all are all the good ones are so far and um so it's gonna be hit or miss um i'm pretty sure the one that's farther away by my daughter's doctor they'll probably have it pretty sure alvin will get it um and then by my brother's way um he's got like two or three walgreens and they're pretty good and then there's one on the way there um, I think it's called 2351 and, and 518. That one's pretty good too. The other ones along Broadway and 518 aren't always up to up to that, you know, carrying the, the new stuff. So, so yeah, just to let you know, California Dreaming. Um, the thing that caught my eye and I don't need like a hole in my head I need is the pastel polishes. <laughs> That's what caught my eye. Um, all new colors for pastel polishes and that purple jelly i think they have purple nude uh, so a couple of warm to like like an orangey uh think of red and um a pink so all of these um they're all gonna be like jellies they have some new liquid liners in there um i'm thinking about getting the green because it's hard to find a good green uh, liquid liner um and then the new nail polishes and i think they've got like a bunch some limited edition bronzers in there if that's what you're into um, so, so yeah, California Dreamers.